In this tutorial, I will guide you through creating a reservation. In your web browser, type cache.mobilityonwheels.com. If you need help logging in, please refer back to the Access and Create Account tutorial. Once your account is established, enter your email address and password. Click the Login button to continue to make a reservation. Select your desired destination from the popular destination list along the right. If you do not see your desired destination listed, you may contact us at rentals at mobilityonwheels.com for assistance. After selecting the destination, select the device you would like to rent by clicking on the picture or the Learn More button. Review the device using the Description tab below the picture of the device. The Rental Rates tab provides the current rental rates. Be sure to select the device most appropriate for the person operating the device with the suggested height and weight listed to the right of the picture. Once you have determined which device you would like to rent, complete the rental application. First, select an operator from the drop-down list or create a new operator by clicking the New Operator button and enter the new operator's information. If you have clicked the New Operator button by mistake, click the Select Existing Operator button and select the operator. Next, select the pickup location, accessory type, pickup date, pickup time, return date, and return time. The rental period, reward points earned if applicable, and the price will calculate based on the dates and times selected. Once you have completed, click the Add to Reservation button. On the Reserved Items page, confirm the reservation details are correct. If you need to make any changes, you may click the Make Changes to Reservation button to go back and edit the reservation. If the reservation details are correct, click the Proceed to Checkout button. If you have a promo code, select Click Here to enter your code link. Enter the promo code and click the Apply Promo Code button. If you have sufficient Rider Reward points to apply a bonus day, click the checkbox. Promo codes and bonus days cannot be combined or applied to the same order. To update your billing address, click the Change Billing Address button. You will be brought to the My Account page where you can update your billing address. After you have completed this, click the Save Changes button. If you do not have any changes to make, click the Back to Checkout button. If you have any additional notes or specific instructions you would like to include, enter them in the order note box. Review your order details one last time before processing your order. If you have an existing credit or debit card on file, select the card you would like to use from the drop-down box. If you do not have an existing card on file or would like to use a new card, click the Add New Credit or Debit Card link. The billing address will auto-pull the information set within your account. Make any necessary changes to be sure the address matches the billing address linked to the card and enter the card information. Once finished, click the Save Changes button. After selecting the card you would like to use for payment, read the payment agreement information. If you do not agree, do not proceed with the rental transaction. If you agree, click the Click Here to Review Training Video, Rental Agreement, and Terms and Conditions link. Watch the training video and read the training video agreement in its entirety. If you do not agree, click the Cancel button and do not proceed with the rental transaction. If you agree, click the I Agree button and proceed to the rental agreement. Read through the rental agreement in its entirety. If you do not agree,
click the cancel button and do not proceed with the rental transaction. If you would like to go back to the training video, click the back button. If you agree, click the I agree button and proceed to the terms and conditions. Read through the terms and conditions in its entirety. If you do not agree, click the cancel button and do not proceed with the rental transaction. If you would like to go back to the rental agreement, click the back button. If you agree, click the I agree button. The pop-up window will close and the checkbox next to the click here to review training video rental agreement and terms and conditions will be checked. Click the place order, click only once button to process the order. Once the order is processed, you will be directed to the order receive page. You will also receive an order confirmation email with a PDF copy of your completed attestations. If you are not the designated operator for this order, the operator will receive a text and email that includes a link to review and complete the attestations. Please remember the operator must view the training video and agree to the training video agreement, rental agreement, and terms and conditions to complete the virtual training process prior to the issuance of any rental device. This concludes the tutorial for creating a reservation. We will continually work to make upgrades to enhance the user experience. Currently under development is the ability to extend, modify, or cancel your reservation from within your user profile. When these enhancements are completed and made available, we will send out email updates that will include short instructional how-to videos to assist you with the new features. Thank you for choosing Mobility on Wheels.